they were doing a story uh, about, well, the WNBA and this very successful thing. And then often, as newscasts do, they go, and here is an expansion on the story. And they thought, let's do a story about more women's sports. Yeah. Women's basketball, how about this? Ontario high school girls with their own first in Toronto taking to the field for some exhibition tackle football. And the more I thought about it, the funny part of it to me was the editor. Yeah. So the guy who got all the video footage and he, he knew the story was pitched. They went to the league. Everyone was excited. And the footage that this guy got, if this made the cut, I cannot imagine the other stuff. And this guy was like... Oh no. <laughs> well, yeah. <laughs> what am I going to do with this? Can you Here's the here's what I think is the funny. That those players knew that that was going to be on the news that night. And they're like, "Oh, gather around the TV family and watch Oh no." <laughs> Why did they show that? <laughs> Why would you show that? Uh, years ago I was watching Wimbledon. And it was it was John McEnroe, and I think it was one of those McEnroe Jimmy Connors matches, mm. and and John McEnroe served the ball, and it was headed right for this kid, and you could hear he was miked, the, he hit the serve, and the kid goes oh goal, <laughs> and the ball <laughs> cracked him right in the head. That's the best. It was the funniest <laughs> thing. <laughs> you could hear him, that moment of panic when you knew. There was something bad about to happen, yep. and there was nothing he could do about yep. it. Oh, gosh. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, especially especially the British, the British kind of polite and just res I'm resigned to doom here, but you know, <laughs> stiff yeah. upper lip and all like that was. <laughs> <laughs>